Oh, look at those. Look at those. What is up guys? My name is Mark Sanamaria. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to RC Vlog. Guys, today we're leaving. We're going to be on the road for 10 days. 10 days for an RC race. We are heading out to White Pines, Tennessee for the Psycho Nitro Blast. The race is actually only three days, but we're going to get there before they all set up. We'll be able to see everything go up. We're going to be on the road for 10 days. It's going to be crazy. I actually just got done pulling all the RC stuff out and into the trailer. The trailer's out here. I'll show you guys around. It's actually pretty cool. Before I go to the RV, check these out. Oh my God. We got new stickers. Look, we got different colors. The blue one. Here, let me show you what the blue one looks like. There it is. Wow. Oh man. What was that? Wow. That was a weird wow. Wow. Look at these stickers. They're freaking awesome. Look, and then I got smaller ones right there. Um, I got to cut them out, but there's something else I got to show you that's really freaking cool. Check out these stickers. Hold on. I, I don't know which hand to use. I'm not left-handed. I'm holding the camera to my right. Look at these. Look at that. I'm a potato. <laughs> oh. oh man, this is awesome. Big shout out to Mac Designs for hooking it up with these. Um, I'll put a link to his website below and also a coupon code to save some money. But Mac Designs hooking it up with the stickers. He dropped them off this morning, so I'd have them for Psycho Nitro Blast. Super cool. Bunch of different colors. Oh man, this is freaking awesome. Hold up. Evan wants to show you his speed bag skills. Get him, buddy. <laughs> I can't even do that, guys. It's hard. Speed bag's a lot harder than you think it is. It's got needs a lot of rhythm, but man, that, that is too fun. All right, we're gonna hop on the old hot rod. Oh crap, I gotta record with my left hand because I am gonna be pulling throttle with the right hand. Here we go. So there's the RV out there. Oh man, whoa, 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 that's sketchy. That was our neighbor. They wanted to come by and check out the uh, the camper. Oh my God, my, my kickstand is up. That's not safe. So I don't actually park the RV here. Um, I park it at my parents' house, but you know, HOAs, they, they don't like stuff like this. And the, sorry, I have to make sure, get off my bike, my shirt was gonna fall down. Uh, they don't like RVs like this or trailers like this in the neighborhood, but I'm allowed to park it in my neighborhood for, I think it's like two days. So usually what happens is I'll go get it from my parents' house and then, yeah, we'll bring it over here and load it up. Let's see what's in it. It's like jam packed in here, guys. Like we haven't even unloaded everything. Oh my God, I almost fell. Who's that? That's Ethan. Oh man, so it's not slid out right now. Lex kind of looks kind of looks like a mess, but we're gonna get it all cleaned up at our first place, our first stop, which will be instant for you guys, but about eight hours for us. Look, I rarely get shots of my house from this angle because I'm always out. So my garage is out around there by the driveway. So you never see, this This is my house right there. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, usually you see me from the garage side, so you don't ever see that side. All right guys, we made it to our first stop. We actually made it into Arkansas. Doing my little walk around the RV to make sure everything's all right. We're at a rest area. The family's actually leaving me behind, so I need, to, I need to get up there. But this is like the Arkansas Welcome Center. Yeah, I had to use the restroom real bad. Usually it's the kids and the, and the wife that have to use the restroom real bad, but in this case it was me, so. You know, it is what it is. All right, one of the many advantages of the RV, Melissa and Ethan are in there making a snack right now. We got a traveling kitchen. Melissa's in there, it's dark. But Evan decides, so he brought his skateboard and he sees the biggest curve he said he's ever seen in his life and he wants to see if he can jump off it. It's a, <laughs> it's a pretty big curve. Look at the size of this curve. We're gonna see if Evan can rip it. He's going. <laughs> He's going off the, there you go, right there. You're gonna have to turn and jump off it. Look at how big this curb is. Go for it, bud. All right, here he goes. Does he do it? Turn and rip. All right, here he comes. Does he do it or does he buckle? Does he do it or buckle? Looks like he's buckling. All right, we don't have all day to figure this out if you're gonna do it or not. Let's go. Come on, Evan, go, 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 go. Oh. All right, guys, we made it to the first stop. We are in Memphis, Tennessee, uh, right on the Mississippi River, which is really cool. We actually arrived here right before it got dark, so it was really, really pretty on the water. Um, I got, we got the RV all set up. However, there was a little scare, a little mini scare. Basically what happened was, 
is I pulled the little cap off the drain, that like the drainage thing where all your doo-doo and everything goes out, and it started spewing out. So it was almost like I left it open on accident. Luckily, it was just the gray tank. Um, so that means that it was just the water that we wash our hands with. So we're okay, but I, for, for a while, I thought I had poop on me. That would have been bad. All right, guys, it's, what time is it, man? 6.51 in the morning, me and Melissa woke up extra early to watch the sunset, sunrise. I keep calling it sunset, she keeps getting mad at me. Sunrise happened on the Mississippi River. It's beautiful out here. Got the uh, TRX-4. Having, doing like glamour shots, some like studio photos. Not studio photos, like scenic photos <laughs> with the TRX-4 this morning. Sorry, it's early, I still got my coffee. I haven't even finished it, but we're almost there. Uh, we'll be there today. Uh, when I say there, the Psycho Nitro Blast in White Pines, Tennessee. Uh, we're about six and a half hours out and we'll probably, we're not gonna rush out of here. Uh, we're gonna take our time. And then we should see you guys in White Pines, Tennessee. So here's our view right now. The sun just rose over the top of those trees over there. Mississippi River, huge. Lots of junk in it though. I guess not trash, but like branches and stuff. Um, there is the RV park that we're staying at. Our RV is behind those big Class C's right there. Class A's? Those aren't any Class C's. I'm telling you guys, I'm off my game right now. This is way too early. Um, let's see, you can kind of see our RV or our trailer right there. That's where we're at. But overall, this is a great start to what's going to be an awesome 10 day, 10 plus day RC adventure. All right guys, we just made it here. We made it to the Psycho Nitro Blast. So I got here, set the trailer up. My wife had to get Melissa, Melissa, you guys know Melissa. Uh, she had to get dinner going, the boys were tired. So they're all in the camper. I just got that done. We're gonna sneak peek of the track right now. It's sun Sunday, Sunday night. Uh, they're about to close down. I ran up here so I could at least get a little bit of the track before we go. But look, here is the little driver's area i think they're gonna have like a driver social which is gonna be really cool oh my god you gotta see this guys you gotta see this oh man here it is guys all right so i'm seeing it for the first time just like you guys this ground is really wet looks like bobby moore is at it right now look at all look at all this dirt whoa this is nuts look at this guy Ooh, that's creepy oh there's another one and wow this is it guys. This is the calm before the storm. They're building this thing up. Look at how big this track is. It's freaking insane. The facility, awesome. Look at this. Back whenever I went, the on the tone canopy was right up there. I don't think they're letting people pit inside anymore. But, all right, I'm gonna try to get in a spot where we can see better about what all this looks like. But here's the announcer's booth, the, uh, the scary monster guys. All this dirt, Bobby Moore. Okay, let's let's go up there and see what it looks like from up up top. If I can get, where, wait, how do I? Oh, all right. I think this is the best view to get a glimpse of what the entire track and facility looks like. Like that's a golf cart right there. So that kind of puts in perspective on how big and psycho this track is going to be. Pun intended. Is that really a pun? I guess not. Announcer's booth. Oh man, this is going to be freaking. Out. My battery's about to die and I can't go back to the trailer and get a new battery because I don't have a lot of time so I might have to finish this one off with the old phone. But wow, this looks awesome guys. Alright guys, I am walking on the track before it's actually built. There's Bobby Moore. It looks like this is going to be a big berm section. So when I ran the track, that was all flat and these were all crazy jumps. But this track is known to have crazy jumps. I promise you guys will see the progress as it happens. But this is nuts guys. Absolutely nuts. All right, guys, here's a little tour of all the, the campers. So they're starting to roll in here. Um, I'm on this side. The track is over there. You can barely see it. I know it's dark. Uh, but over here, we're going to go check out over here. These are the guys behind Race Time Entertainment. Uh, that's Mr. Dave. He's the main promoter. Then you got Bobby Moore, the guy who builds the track. Here's all. See, all these people, they don't even know that I'm coming up here to record. Um, but we're coming up here. We're just going to kind of sneak up in here. And just try to figure out what's going on. Here we go. We're in. What? No. <laughs> we both like, Wait we a both, minute. We both like nice oh. sign. Oh. Whoa. 
Oh, what's up? Whoa. What's up, buddy? What's up? No, we're not. Everyone just having oh, having wait, some hey. growth. We're all getting we're all being mean to each other. We're all being there's Bobby oh, Moore. Oh wait. Um, yeah, we're all crack. trying to lose a Bob. friend here. <laughs> Bob. Maybe I try this out. Bob. All right, now someone fall in the fire so make this video really good. Okay. Right, no, I'm just joking. Yeah, no. Coop. <laughs> Get up. No, I'm good. no, he's gonna do it. <laughs> All right, guys, that's a wrap. Back in the RV, I'm gonna get to editing so you guys can see this as fresh as possible. Tomorrow, I want to do a time lapse. We'll get more of the track build, um, and then I gotta start cleaning my cars up because I haven't even started working on my cars at all. But oh man, it's been a long journey. I hope you guys liked this video, guys. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification bell, and you guys will see me next time. Later, guys.